side of the head. Yeah. I'm going to fold this leg in against here, so obviously you might want to do it there. Okay. And then I'm going to do, step over and sit back. And that is already on. Yeah. I don't need to take the hand out, that's just helping. So this foot's underneath the shoulder there, and this one <coughs> over the neck. That was way too easy. Yeah. <laughs> I've got other hands. No, I'm not really. So, again, <laughs> as this arm comes through, what, what, or it might end up at the start there to start with, but what I'm going to do is give it a bit of a hand to yeah. fit through. A lot of people will just let that go, yeah, because this, is, this isn't a bad position to have to the hand in. But I'm just going to cut back the elbow. Not obtrusively, I don't want to grip it really hard, because then they'll notice I've got it there, but I'm just going to cup it. Okay. Fold the lower leg in, step over the head and sit back. This knee comes up towards the ceiling and that's already on. Okay. That's one of my favourite arm bars from side control. Because it does, it feels like there's nothing there until suddenly there is. Yeah. If, if from the point of view of the person I'm bossing, it feels almost like I've missed out a step. <laughs> Anyone want to fill up? Yeah. <coughs> Middle name is stupid, but there you go. <laughs> Wait, let me on the back, please. Okay, so I control. Stop bringing this arm in to make space. This is actually a good, good move. It's a good thing to do. I'm just going to help him control it through. Cut the back of the elbow. Fold my lower leg in. Step over, and then this comes up, and that's already on. Oh, that's pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> I think you should turn professional. <laughs> <laughs>